What's going on YouTube? Ravenous here, bringing you another troll build episode. And today we're going to do all tornado trigger cruel. But in order for me to do that, I got to go ahead and unlock this guy first. So go ahead and drop a little ice on cruel, uh, get him going and get into a casual match. So um, hang tight, man. And uh, <laughs> it, it was a pretty good episode, man. I mean, pretty good match, I would say. Um, had a little uh, trouble in the beginning. Uh, we were going up against a CP Jewel. I think we had a weapon Kestrel in the lane, and then he had a Catherine. So triple stun comp against myself, man. It was uh, it's kind of rough. I went ahead and locked in the cruel here. Uh, we did get a CP Ringo, and guest went with the uh, Rome Black Feather. So uh, yep, there's Kestrel Jewel and Catherine. And uh, right here, we're just going to get into the uh, farm. Um, Blackfeather seems pretty um, pretty smart about you know going one, two, three, four. I start the one, he's starting the twos. Um, he's doing pretty good, man. I uh, have to give it to him. He actually turned out to be a pretty good uh, Blackfeather. Uh, pretty good roam at that. So uh, even though he was guest, man, I got a little worried thinking you know, it was going to be a, a noob. But uh, I think... Whenever I do these troll build episodes, it's the success of the uh, video is usually determined on my other two teammates. So right here, as I was getting the uh, the last four, I went ahead and bought a swift shooter. And uh, the last few cruel episodes that I was doing, guys, I had a lot of comments on make sure you get your passive up. And I tried to do that for the most part uh, for this match. Uh, tried to remember in the beginning. Of course, there towards the end, you know you. In the heat of the battle, you kind of slip up on a few things, you know what I mean? Uh, not like I'm a VG player right now, or I should say Vainglorious, but, um, you know, we're working on it. So I get the boots and uh, just go back to the farm. I really don't want to engage early right away. I want to get at least one tornado trigger before I really start trying to do something. So pick up the salvo, or I pick up a minion split, it looks like, since I already had two swift shooters. And right here, we just put a little damage. I knew that they were in there. Um, I think uh, Blackfeather did flare. I'm not sure what happened. Maybe I saw him going in. But anyways, go ahead and took their force. So there's a positive already in our favor. So get my passive up and go all the way back to the number one. Continue on the farm. You know, that's, uh, that's the majority of uh, the beginning of this match. So that's why I went ahead and sped it up for you guys. Because uh, not a lot of action just yet, but wait for it. <laughs> like Vox's ult, right? So uh, getting our three, getting our four, just you know, continuing to go right here. I'm trying to uh, stutter step as best as I can. Um, you know, I'm just trying to do whatever you know I can uh, with Cruel. They, uh, they were pretty good with their vision. So as soon as I got um, spotted, I went ahead and went back. And right here, I'm waiting for the Blackbird to engage, get my passive up, and continue. You know, right here, after I think the second tornado trigger, I was just like, man, I think I'm slowing the cruel down by trying to stutter step, so I just pretty much autoed it. Uh, but for right here, I went ahead and tried to stutter step as best as I can, get that attack speed uh, quickly as I can. So, right here, lucky strike, getting very close to my first tornado trigger. Uh, put a little damage on the jewel, make them back off, and um, weren't able to get their threes or their fours. And right here, I'm checking the shop, trying to see where I'm at, getting very close to that tornado trigger. One more, and we should be good to go. So after this rotation, I do believe I am able to pick up my first uh, tornado trigger. And let's see, yeah, getting our twos. And I tell the uh, black feather, go ahead and start this uh, minion mine. Because that right there is going to help me get the uh, tornado trigger. That payout that we get from it. I'm, I'm kind of digging the new the new minion mines. They pay out uh, more and they pay out sooner. You know what I mean? If that makes any sense. So right here they return the favor. They do take our fours. And now I'm ready. Right? So I'm looking, looking. Can't find them. And there they are. Make sure I get my passive. Then I charge in. Or at least I thought I had my passive up. So they spot me, you know, can't do anything. So I go ahead and back out, or at least I wanted to. 
uh, trying to engage and boom CP jewel shot to the face and there's the first kill of the match unfortunately so yeah a uh, little little struggle just but it's only one death that's the first death of the entire match and now there's the second one we did uh, the black feather did die so Jules trying to uh, invade get a little farm but I back her off go ahead and pick up my one try to get just a little bit more I think um, this next rotation or this next pass I'm gonna pick up my uh, tier 2 boots just so I can be a little bit more mobile they probably took my three uh, looks like they took the four as well pick up my passive get my nope, no boots just yet but there they are so right here I go ahead and start putting some damage on the jewel black feathers backing me up puts a little slow on them and right here I think I am able to pick up the jewel yes drop the smite on her get the sword toss onto the Catherine me and black feather tear, tear her up pretty good there's a uh, Kestrel still in the lane so I go ahead and back off I use this opportunity to try to just go ahead and uh, starve them out a little bit or at least start to begin the pressure if you know what I mean so get their three get their regen and let's see looks like I'm getting uh, working towards the next uh, tornado trigger and right here at this point you see the uh, the speed of the cruel and <laughs> I guess I was just uh, looking at the mini map uh, for that split second and I leave my backs you know just cuz uh we, we won that fight so I'm gonna go ahead and try to put some pressure on uh, black feather put a little poke on the kestrel right here I uh, made a mistake boom <laughs> they ulted just so I, they can secure the kill so it is what it is it happens but uh yeah I gotta remember man on these troll builds that I have no defense so I gotta go in and out in and out especially for the melee heroes you know I try to do most of my troll build episodes with uh, ranged heroes just so I can try to kite as best as possible since I am real squishy <laughs> and right here I'm trying to do a little stutter stepping but not working out so great uh, pretty much cruel can auto these a little bit faster than I can uh, while I'm stutter stepping so I think this is the one where I get my tier 2 boots finally uh, they do pick up the black feather and he's able to pick up the fountain there's my boots so right here I notice cruel or the jewel is very low she blocks my ultimate and I go ahead and just boot away get a little fountain going and now I'm trying to run 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 because <laughs> they got me so low but the uh, black feathers back my ones go ahead and pop so go ahead and get started on that get the passive up that's that's something that it looks like I've improved on as far as this match I think that's just because that was one of my main focuses go ahead and make sure that uh, cruel has this passive up so right here get it up again and they were working the gold mine so I just go in for the kill right they do get the payout but we pick up the jewel and I think right here we're chasing down the Kestrel yeah we're gonna we're gonna pick her up now make them pay for that uh, the gold mine play that they just did and pick up the ace so go ahead and get the uh, second minion mine and we tell Ringo go ahead and pick up the uh, turret so all is well go ahead and just starve them out just take take control of their jungle take their backs take everything <laughs> take it all so um, now we're just working our way back uh, looks like Ringo was not able to pick up the uh, turret just yet so I just go ahead and continue on and I think I get my Oh, journey boots. <laughs> yeah, I, I go ahead and try to max out journey boots mainly because uh, that's like the only extra health benefit that I get while doing these uh, troll build videos. And I just left my jungle alone. I went ahead and what came back and I tried to uh, catch Jewel on the back end, you know, do the boomerang effect, but uh, was unsuccessful. So I just go back, come down, and I'm gonna try to invade the jungle since I noticed all three were there. So right here I'm waiting, waiting for the jewel, catch her out. Um, she does come in, but the black feather's there to help slow her. And we do end up catching up to her. And I believe I dropped my spite. No, not the smite, but I do hit do uh, my A ability. Uh, I think it's Dead Man's Rush, I believe is what it's called. So right here I'm looking for Catherine. Um, nothing really happens. We're just going back and forth, back and forth. Uh, Kestrel's back in the lane now, I believe. And so we just go ahead and take their uh, farm. 
go ahead and take all of their jungle, take the backs, take the one, and work their way up. At this point, you know, we're just trying to keep the pressure on best as best as we can. Uh, Kestrel messed with her glimmer shot, so I'm just taking their threes or the fours now. And next shop, I do believe I get my second trigger. Get another minion's foot. Go back, get my fours. <laughs> Look at how fast they're, those lanes or those minions are getting cleared, man. Get my passive up. Go back into the lane one more time. Passive up, and right here, get the gank on the Kestrel. Boom! Very nice. So use a little stutter step action to get that kill. And at this point, I'm trying to wait to see if I can get the jewel. I'm trying to do the boomerang again. I failed on that. Uh, there's the stun, there's the silence, and Catherine with her silence was able to secure the kill. So, GG. <laughs> Rip. But, uh, it is 14 minutes, man. I should have paid more attention to that. Uh, I pinged him to go ahead and try to focus the turret, but now that the barrier's there, I cautioned it. But, uh, as soon as I go up, it looks like they're gonna go ahead and secure the uh, turret anyways. So, that's good. You know, good on their part. And right here, I noticed that all three, they're on a 2v, a 3v2 for the most part. Catherine's chasing uh, Blackfeather. He's trying to get out the Ringos up there. So right here, I go ahead and boot in, try to uh, help best as I can. Notice the Kestrel's uh, pretty much out of position. I try to secure the kill on her, and I do pick her up. Now I'm working on the Jewel, trying to get her. I get didn't wait till I got my full stack, so... If I would have had full stacks on her, I could have probably secured the kill. But, uh, anyways, they boot out, they warhorn. Um, or at least, uh, Catherine does. And right here, we're just gonna go ahead and try to get some more farm before we, uh, engage on them one more time. Let's see. At this point, I do double infuse just because I know we're at the Kraken point and we need to make a play before we try to go and secure the Kraken. At least get a second turret. So I do get the uh, the regen, and I caution Blackfeather, don't go to the backs. We need to go up front. One, mainly being because I'm double infused, right? So we need to take an advantage of that. And here I am getting my passive up one more time, and another passive <laughs> uh, activation. I'm trying to work on this turret, but they're all engaging on us. So back off just a bit. Uh, pretty much, I just focus on whoever's near me at the time, right? Blackfeather does die. Um, I'm able to uh, get the jewel, it looks like, or get her down pretty low. I back away. Ringo's kiting. Now he ults the Catherine. Uh, jewel was in the midst of that, so I was able to pick her up. Now I'm working on the Kestrel, slowing her down. Got my full stacks, but I don't drop my uh, smite on her. I just go ahead and use my dead man's rush. And Catherine was so low, but Ringo is too, so I'm kind of cautioning him. Hey, man, just be careful. Watch out. And at this point, I go ahead and work on the Kraken. Go ahead and start it. Just auto it. Uh, use my A's and B's whenever they're up. I'm trying to uh, keep track of where everything is at. Uh, Catherine is going to come, so as soon as she does, I stun her. Turn, back, turn my attention back to her trace her away for the most part and between us three we pick up the Kraken pretty easily and now I just pick up the salvo and the lucky strike since I'm still partially infused um, now right here I do make a mistake I shouldn't have charged in right away I should have really just let the black feather go in but um, triple stun comp man that's one thing you gotta be cautious of so as soon as I go in right there they stun another stun and then just Kestrel with the shot. Uh, Jewel did pick up the kill, but right here, guys, look at Blackfeather putting in some work. Just nasty, man. So, on the last engagement when he died, I was putting in the work, and this one he returns the favor. And, uh, yeah, man, pick up the turret, and right here, they're gonna dive on this Catherine, pick her up, secure the kill, Warhorn, boom, GG, man. So, Blackfeather, whoever you are, good job, bro. Very, very nice. And right here, I am able to get the third tornado, third tornado trigger for this uh, episode. So, not bad, guys. Uh, pretty good game so far. Um, they do end up surrendering. Spoiler alert. <laughs> there it is. There's the surrender. Uh, try to get the jewel, but she jumped out. There's her ultimate. But, uh, 
yeah, that's it, man. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, six, four, and five on my part. Uh, two, zero, three, I think, on the Ringo. Six, three, four for the Black Feather. Uh, 100 creep score, 134 on the Ringo. Three tornado triggers. He went alternating current and clockwork. Black Feather standard support stuff, man. Kestrel, Aftershock, alternating current. So, GG. There it is, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, leave me a comment down below of what you would like to see next or would you like me to try. Um, hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you on the next episode.